Is this thing on? Hello there, my friend. Welcome to my kitchen. It's so nice to see you. I'm Chef Louie. So, you want to learn all the secrets of my celebrity friends when it comes to what they eat, hmm? Well, let's see what we can cook up today. Before we get cooking, click the subscribe button and the notification bell too. Help support Bestie by watching this video until the end. All right, all right, don't mind that. So whose diet were you interested in today? Oh, you've heard about my celebrity friends Jessica Biel and Matthew McConaughey who eat the same as our ancestors did back in the Stone Age. That one is called the Paleo Diet, my friend. So picture this. You are in a cave and hungry. What are you going to eat? You can't eat rocks. No, no, no. You're gonna catch fish. You're going to forage for berries and nuts. Eat as many leafy greens as you want. You are wild and untamed. Well, maybe not so much the last part. And you don't actually have to fight off any bears if you wanna get some fish. You can just go to the grocery store. The point of this diet is basically anything processed is out of the question because our ancestors couldn't eat them, so neither can you. There is a bit of a catch though. With this diet, the doctors say you'll have to exercise regularly too. No? That wasn't the diet you were thinking of? Okay, okay. How about this one? The Mediterranean diet, huh? Oh, you know who swears by this one? My good friend and neighbor, John Goodman. Oh, and I think Penelope Cruz as well, but yes, the Mediterranean diet is very simple and you can do it no problem. This is a diet modeled after those who live in the Mediterranean, which includes lots of fatty fish, whole grains, nuts, and lots of fruit and veggies. Celebrities like this swear that this diet gives you lots of energy and some claim that it'll add years to your life. But of course, that's not something we can really measure now, can we? I'm a chef, not a doctor. Is that the one you're after? No, oh, okay. Okay, you are hard to please, I get it. No problem, let me see. Ah, I've got it, you're old school. You're probably thinking of the Adkins diet. You know who uses that one? The famous English royalty herself, Pippa Middleton. You know her, Kate's sister? Yes, she's very fancy and yes, swears by the Adkins diet. So this one was first promoted by Dr. Robert C. Atkins, who says that you must limit yourself to high protein and low carb meals. This one is perfect if you're trying to get ready for those summer beach days. Wanna shed a couple pounds off, yes? The idea is that you can eat as much protein as you want. So meat, eggs, broccoli, chicken, that kind of thing. And you want to avoid carbs like bread, starchy vegetables, and no beer. Don't be scared, this diet has a bad reputation, but now, not so much. People are jumping back on board and it's not so bad. Was that? Still not the diet you want? Okay, you are hard to please, but the finer things in life cannot be rushed, like a fine wine. Okay, let's see what else I have for you on the menu. How about something a little more modern for you? Okay, do you know the celebrity Lady Gaga? Huh. How about Katy Perry and Rihanna? Haha, -ha, yes, I see, you know them. They are my friends too. I'm very popular. I'll tell them to say hello the next time they come to see me. The famous Chef Louis. Okay, so they follow a strange but pretty simple diet secret. The number five, well, it's called the five factor diet. You eat five times a day, and the meals have only five ingredients. Can you imagine only five? I would go out of business if I served that every day. I only do it for special friends like Megan Fox. So you have your plate, and you have five ingredients that include protein, complex carbs, fiber, fat, and fluids, plus one day to cheat. Not saying you're a cheater, but everyone likes to take a day off once in a while, no? Hmm, still not satisfied yet, huh? Okay, know what? Let's go a completely new route. One where you don't have to cook at all. 
Yes, nothing. This is a very special diet used by my good friends Demi Moore and Woody Harrelson. The raw diet means no processed foods. They have to be completely unrefined and unpasteurized. It doesn't sound that delicious in my opinion, but celebrities like my friends I mentioned earlier say that it can help you lose weight. It gives you more energy, improves your health, and has very little impact on the environment. The food on this diet cannot be heated above 104 to 118 degrees Fahrenheit, or between 40 and 48 degrees Celsius for my Canadian friends. My friends claim that if you don't cook something, you keep its life force and are eating living foods. So if you can't cook the food, how can you eat the food? Well, that's up to you. You can blend it, juice it, dehydrate it, soak it. The possibilities are endless, except for cooking. That's out of the question. I don't know about this one though. Some of the doctors that come into my restaurant say this diet isn't very good for you. So, you know, I would play it safe and ask your own doctor. Chef Louie doesn't want to get in trouble, you know what I mean? All right, I didn't think that one was for you. It requires a bit more dedication. Okay, Chef Louie has one more thing we can try. What do you think about the ketogenic diet? The keto diet for short, if you want to sound cool like my celebrity friends and I, that's what we call it when we're hanging out. So this keto diet is one that Kim Kardashian, Gwyneth Paltrow, and even LeBron James is on it. They say it helps them out with weight loss and it can also be beneficial to someone who has diabetes. It's all about eating way more fat and way less carbs. It's a bit of a weird diet, but you can have meat, fish, eggs, leafy greens, nuts, cauliflower, cheese, avocado, and uh... Oh, hang on, let me get that. Hello? Yes. Yes. Uh... Yes, I forgot about that. Yes. Right now? Okay, bye. Okay, so that was my doctor friend. She just called me to tell you about the risks that come along with the keto diet and wanted me to tell you about them before I keep babbling on about it. First of all, it's a really odd diet plan. You have to cut carbs almost completely, which can leave you feeling hungry. She also said that you can get what some people call the keto flu, which happens once you become dehydrated and experience headaches, kidney stones, lack of fiber, and vitamin deficiency. Okay, so that's what all my friends eat. Are you ready to order? What? You only wanted a Diet Coke, not a diet plan? And you want a large cheese pizza? Okay, this is a fancy place, but for you? Yep, coming right up. One large cheese to go. Have you tried any of these diets? Let us know in the comment section below what diet has worked for you and what hasn't. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait, what kind of Bestie would we be if we didn't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video and enjoy.